y'all, welcome back to Banjo Kazooie, where we're heading off to Mad Monster Mansion. We've got everything done so far, so we need to head on up there and see what's next. And I'm glad you have IGN open because we're gonna need it for this next one. Naturally. All right. Let's go this way. That's the wrong way. <laughs> Ah, we! Oh, we missed something. Oh, well, who cares? Yeah, who cares for right now? Alright, so we need to go... Actually, I'm going to go ahead and rob these beehives while we can. Good idea. We're going to need all the health we can get. Health isn't so much a problem in this next one. It's the map itself that's the problem. Okay, so the picture for... Um, the picture that you have to put the jiggies in is next to the one that you, you put Gobi's Valley into. I believe it. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's Gobi's Valley. The next one should be Mad Monster Mansion. Next picture, he says. Also, that way, there's a witch lady over there. Yep. It, uh, is it time for, for, for typing? Yes. The good news is, you actually have to come back this way as like a termite or whatever a small creature is to get into a tiny little hole. Fortunately, I know that in that tiny little hole is only a cheat code, so we're not gonna do that. That is so good that you know that. Yes! Because you have maybe go back here to figure out what's in that hole. Alright, time to type. Rotting fish! I thought it'd be something more special than just fish. Z rotting fish, to be exact. A Veruga plant. Spotty purple undies. I'm sure someone here wouldn't care. When is Gruntilda? I absolutely do. Yeah! I'm glad we found your line. <laughs> yeah, she's absolutely revolting. Even in, you know, you lose the game form. She would still be re Whoops! revolting in, in what she does, even in that beautiful form. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can change a person's outside, you can't change their inside. Mm hmm. Even, I mean. I can't imagine how awful her breath must be when she has rat bagels for breakfast, maggot pie for dinner, and rat sorbet with dessert while brushing her teeth with moldy cheese! No amount of beauty can fix that! This looks like Monster Mansion itself. It's just the painting that should be right there. That door is locked. You're not gonna believe this. It's actually next to Rusty Bucket Bay. Oh, so now he tells me. I missed. I missed. Okay, uh, this is the way to get into the place. I misread. Uh huh. So it's so the painting is next to Rusty Bucket Bay. Okay. Well, we're gonna walk all the way back there. You're gonna have to sing the or do the dance of contrition for making me waste my time coming over here. How about instead I do the dance of Italy? The dance of contrition. Mm, I don't know. It's all do the dance of Italy. The dance of contrition. Again, I can't break dance. You can just do the uh, the uh, Roger version. That is the break dancing one. Then what? The, what about the old one then? The old one will require me to split an atom. Huh. Do you really want my death over a mistake? Yes. Some religions do require you to kill yourself if you, like, do a horrible mistake. Yeah, but I don't practice Shinto, okay? I practice Shinto and you must die! Then I can bake you into a pie! <laughs> Good rhyme. But, um, but I will do the Dance of Italy and send you the clip. <laughs> we'll see about that. Bye, sir! This is the wrong way. 
It's it's next to Rusty Bucket Bay. I'm a growing. Rusty Bucket Bay. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Let me check again. Okay, in the room with Gruntilda's head, head up the big slope and enter the note door. 450 notes required. In the next area, it jump, is. Into the water, uh. jump into the water and swim through the tunnel. The next room features the entrance to Rusty Bucket Bay. There isn't anything we can do besides enter the next underwater tunnel. Swim through the tunnel and you'll find it. I'm not looking forward to Rusty Bucket Bay. Just so you know. Yar, you be you be scared of pirates, matey? But in case you don't know, what do you know about Oops! Rusty Bucket Bay. Yar, I know there be a gay frog there. Are you serious? Because that's completely incorrect. Arr, I know there be a gay frog in this game. Or it's either this one or the next one. There I can confirm there is no gay frog in this game. Yar. I am sorry to disappoint you. Yeah. I don't know everything. Yeah, Rusty Bucket Bay is considered the worst level in the game. Yeah, I can imagine why it's probably underwater. Stop chomping. I thought you were about to say stop doing the pirate voice. No, I'm talking to the fish. Good. I kind of like doing the pirate voice, yeah. You should play Sea of Lies then, that's a great pirate game. Oh, I'd also like to play Sea of Thieves. Yeah. Sea of Thieves? I tried! For free. It wasn't my cup of tea. You don't like tea? Oh, you I guess didn't... you also don't like me! Obviously. Aha! All that swimming for a room where I can't get up. You'll find a way. Hello, fish. Swim over you and hope you don't see me. Whoop, nice try, fish. Yeah, he wanted a piece of angel ass for dinner. I will not comply. Did not consent. Will never consent. Uh, excuse me. No excuses. And there be bad monster mansion. It does kind of look like the mansion from Super Mario 64, don't it? Except the music's better. If you like organ, that is. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Don't touch that, it's nature's mockery! I I want that mumbo token, though. Because eventually the mumbo tokens are going to get placed in hard-to-reach spots, and I'd rather have as many as I can beforehand. Okay, just don't get deep root disease. I might not have a choice. Wait for organs. Aha! I hate organ music. I've grown to like it. I Not haven't. because of your dislike. Just over the years, I've actually started to appreciate it. If there's organ music at my funeral, I'm haunting you all for the rest of eternity. Organ music, if you insist. You really want my ghost haunting you for the rest of eternity? As to, you can only haunt me if you're in hell. In heaven, no, you have to be nice to me. No. Haunting means that they're right next to you at all times. Hmm. It's a good thing I don't believe in ghosts. I do. I've seen them in my dreams. <laughs> I've been Dream memes. I've been visited. Dream memes. Said me. One more hole. Back in the hole. We you go down the hole. We need to go to Club Hall. Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty. Early in the morning, our song shall rise to thee. Okay, that's sounding a little bit sacrilegious the way you're saying it. I don't think it is, but I might be wrong. <laughs> it sounds like you're making fun of it, to be honest. I know you're not. Fucking hell. Well, okay. Alright, so now we need you to think go that's find bad. Whoops! You think that's bad? Whoops! You should hear what someone else had said. In their elaborated parody of the Sacrament of Confession. Oh, Lord. Yes. Like, at the end of it, he was like, Now, I want you to say your act of acknowledgeing the satanicness of your 
nature or some stupid thing like that. Instead of active contrition. Mm. It's kind of funny. I bet that I bet that raised a few eyebrows. <laughs> it was on a Discord chat, so it couldn't raise too many eyebrows. Anyway, Madden's Dimension, where we have constant organ music. Yay! That's the, that's one of the easiest ways to annoy me, and now you know it. So I know you're going to abuse that. I save your ears. Ah. Thank you. I, I, I know you like the music here, but I fucking hate the organ. Of course, that means we need music, so give me a sec. Okay, we are playing random music instead of game music to respect the wishes of the person whose this channel is. A louder, I, I guess. I actually can't hear it. Oh, you won't be able to hear it, but the viewers will. And I will. And that's what matters. Right, viewers? As long as I don't have to hear the organ music on time. Oh, I guess I should not have put on organ sonata 5. Don't worry, I'm joking. Good. But yeah, now you know the easiest Whoops! way to annoy me. <laughs> hey, laugh at me mockingly and maybe I'll turn the organ music back on. No, I wasn't mocking you. I was, I was laughing at your sudden... Whoops! Oh, okay. I thought you were mocking me. My bad. No, I don't. I'm not mocking you. I seriously... I love that. I love that reaction. <laughs> I'm glad, because it's the closest you'll get to reaction from me when something goes wrong. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops! Yeah. I actually think I heard you that from my grandmother. She used to say that whenever something would go wrong, and I just loved it so much that I started doing it in video games. You know what I inherit? What uh, mannerism I inherited from my grandma? The talking? Uh, no. Um, I I have to eat food in an order. In an order? Oh no! Yeah, I'm one of those people who can't just eat what eat willy nilly. I have to finish one thing before I can start another. That's not the worst mannerism in the world. I actually kind of have respect for people who do that. Well, then I guess for once you respect me. This is the one time, mind you, one that I give you a sliver of respect. Yeah, but like if I have like a burger, a fries, a fries, and a cinnamon roll for dessert. I have to eat it in the order of finish burger, finish fries, then eat cinnamon. I can't, I can't force myself to do anything else. Fair. And I inherited that mannerism from my grandma, who was the exact same way. Meanwhile, my mom just eats everything as it goes along. Nom 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 nom. I eat this, Pretty I eat much. that, I eat everything in between. Pretty much, but yeah, I, I literally can't do it any other way. I've tried, it sucks. I didn't mean to come here for a Well, at least you got an Ecom Bokum out of it. Oh, Bokum Apple while he's weeping. I can hear someone creeping. Yeah, you're, this is a sneaky section, and I unfortunately failed it because I got hit. Actually, what, remember how you you're supposed to beat this? I, I, I am intrigued at how you're going to, uh, how you're going to do when you get to Hitman Absolution because of your inability to do sneaking. I am bad at stealth, and I don't know why. You are going to get shot so much. To be fair, I wasn't even... Ah, we'll deal with this later. How do I open the door? I do not know. Do you want me to look up online? Because last time you, last time I, okay, never mind. <laughs> last time, last time I gave you instructions from IGN, you yelled at me. Because they were probably wrong. No, they were correct. You just didn't want to be told the answer. Right, because I was, I wasn't ready for all the answers. I was only wanted specific answers. Specific. I've learned my lesson about giving, giving you. Uh, Big hands. Specific! Uh, I'll even find more talkative when I have my own music playing than oh, God, I, I forgot game. that the toy I forgot the toilet's alive. I would 
I would want to kill myself if I was a living toilet. Gurgle. Bear is much too fat to fit in Logo's mouth. I'm glad! Goodbye! You're gonna have to come back, though. I know. God, can you imagine, could you imagine how much he hates his life? We don't know if he hates his life. Ugh, that made it worse. Ah! <laughs> Hi, sir. <laughs> that scream, though. <laughs> right. I'm not mocking you, I, severe, I seriously love that scream. Bye! Anyone else? We can't do that yet, unfortunately. Yeah, you're too big. Banjo's too fat to fit under there. But we're acknowledging other locations so that you might help me remember some things for a change. I will do the best I can, and anything I forget, I have idea. Yep. Bird? Bird's just gonna kill you. Nope, I killed Bird. Bird go bye bye. I go bye bye. Honestly, I imagine I imagine if Banjo ever ordered. Fine, fried we'll go this place, way. I imagine if Banjo ever ordered fried chicken at a place, uh, Kazooie would give him the side eye the whole time. Yep. You hear something? Let's try. There's another one. Yeah, it's a picture of the pirate from SpongeBob. Yar. You know his name's Patchy, right? No, because I don't watch SpongeBob. His name was Patchy and he's played by Tom Kenny. Is Tom Kenny still on that show or did he give up and move on? He's still on that show. The show's still fucking going. He's literally the voice of SpongeBob. I don't know. Honestly, he should have died with Steven Hillenburg. Whoa! And no, I don't respect him. You don't respect Kenny? No, I don't respect Hillenburg. Uh. He had ALS this whole time and could have used his riches to fu help fund a cure, but he didn't. He just sat down and died. A cure for what? ALS! Ah. Uh. Which he had, but no, he just had to sit around and do nothing. I don't respect Stephen Hillenburg. Maybe he just didn't care. Exactly why I shouldn't care about him. I don't respect him. And that's the end of that. Bang's time. If I had a life-threatening disease and I had all that cash, I would be using it to try and fund a, a cure. Alright. I trust you would. Especially since I have the risk factors for it. I have the genes. It's hereditary. Aha! Ginger. Good. Watch out for the ghosty goo. Oh, he's gone. But now he's really gone. There. Yep. How do you kill a ghost? I think you just send him back to the Shadow Realm. You've activated my trap card! Go us. And I have all, all the pieces of Exodia. Wow! That's by, the way, in by the way, in case you don't know, if you have all the pieces of Exodia, you literally won. It's impossible to beat. <laughs> wow! It's like I learned something new! Yeah, it's like having a royal flush. If you if you play all the pieces of Exodia, you win no matter what. Nice. There's no card that there's no card that defeats Exodia. I do like knowing cards that are powerful. Oh, really, game? It's the other way. Mm-hmm. Oops, that video's too big. It's on the capture screen. That's why the other day when we were talking, Joe was Joe was talking, we were talking about how unlucky I was at the moment, and, and uh, he, he, Joe said, you will never have an Exodia deck. No, you won't. Also, can't you get through there? It looked like there was a way through. No, we have to go the other way. Mm. Ironically, talk had... about, ironically talk about cards and Megalovania starts playing. <laughs> 
For those who don't know, uh, well, I guess I can ask this question so that you can respond for the viewers. Do you know how to play the card game Rook? No, I've never even heard of it. Okay, well, it's a fun card. There was health there, apparently. I think that was from the bird that you killed. I think so, too. Anyway, there's a fun variant I play when I do Rook. Um, if for some reason... I can't talk over that weird thing. For some reason, uh, if you have a hand that you know can beat whatever the person put the bid on the on the on the round is, you just pull out your phone and start playing Megalovania, and then you proceed to set the player. Nice. I've only seen it happen once, but it was beautiful. Every time I hear Megalovania, I always think you feel like you're going to have a bad time. Oh, the nicer <laughs> play is when we get to Rusty Becca Bay. Oh great, there are, there's Oregon music now, for some reason. Did that thing just say, fuck you? That's what some people think, it didn't though. It sounded just like it said, fuck you. Is it Golden Feather time? I mean, it could be. For what? Unfortunately, I guess there's no way I can change the music here. That's okay. I'll just deal with it. It's not even Oregon music anymore, it's tuba. Well, it was Oregon when you when you stood in front of the house. Uh. What is it with haunted places and organ music? I don't know. Wow, these are hard know, hits. Oregon, Oregon music just seems so sad to me, and I don't like sad stuff. I love sad stuff. No kidding. Okay. That doesn't make any sense. Why can't can you get behind it and shoot? There we go. Thank you. He says thank you, by the way. He says he says thank you, but the person really should enunciate better. Now it, it sounds it sounds just like he says fuck you. That's probably the point. Bye! I mean, Rare does like to get away with, with, uh, sexual humor a lot. Where they can, at least. The, in the... <laughs> in one... In a, in a restaurant in, like, I think Banjo-Tooie, there's a, uh, on, on, on the menu, there's something called a semen surprise. Yeah! Uh, I know what that's supposed to be spelled like, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Semen as in as in a man of the sea, but it sounds like semen as in you know. The other option. Well, now that you said that word, we can guarantee this video won't get flagged as four kids. As, as well as all the times I've said, fuck you. Right, I ain't died. Whoops! I'm getting hungry. Ah, because I ate before I came. That's what you get for not eating! I said I ate before I came here. Ah. Which doesn't explain why I'm hungry. The music's Ooh, back. theremin! I love the theremin. Well, we could go ahead and actually stop here if you'd like. No, 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 keep going. Let's finish the episode. I was saying that because I'll... it's time to end the episode. Oh, also, I'm about okay. to die. Yeah, okay, well, we'll finish this next time. Next time, we continue Mad Monster Mansion. So thank y'all for watching this episode of Banjo-Kazooie. If you liked it, leave us a like. If you're new around here, subscribe. Go check out Anthony's channels, and we'll see you next time. Channels? Oh, yeah, Rick. I'm JFK from Clone High, and I am telling you to subscribe to the Geeky Skunk Gamer and his friends. Geo Joe 2000 and uh, uh, Luigi Fan 891!